All right, you guys. Let me give you a little peek behind the scenes here, okay? <laughs> when the mics come on and we start the show, you guys probably think this is a prepared show. <laughs> He's been sitting in here 20, 30 minutes doing show prep, trying to figure out what we're going to talk about in the very first segment, maybe. Let me give you a little peek behind the scenes. It is a cluster F sometimes. <laughs> Before we start the show. There are people scrambling in here sometimes 30, 60 seconds before we hit the mic. Sometimes you come in here and you're so scattered you don't even know what day it is, Kristen. I swear to God I thought it was Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, and y'all were actually really sweet about it. And Cassie's like, no, honey, like look behind you. You can look at, we're not messing with you. It's really Friday. You can look behind you on the TV screen and it has like the actual date, like the day of the week and the date. I don't know why. I mean, I'm, I'm happy about it. Uh -huh. I don't know why. No doubt. I don't know why I was so excited. It was Thursday. That's if you're gonna air though. Yeah. That's the better way to air, right? When you think it's Friday and it's Thursday, then you're yes. like, oh, this day is gonna be so long. This is like a bonus day now for you. It 100 percent is. So Kristen <laughs> runs in here all scattered, and she's like, okay, I just want to let you guys know for the first break. Wait a second, it's Thursday, so we're not doing that. And then Cassie goes, no, it's Friday, and she's like, no, no, no. And she stares at the clock like... She wouldn't accept it. She wouldn't accept it. No. <laughs> you wouldn't accept that it was Friday. Oh, we've messed with her one too many times. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's the hazards of working uh, working here. So that's the first layer. And then the second layer is Mo being Mo, where he goes, <laughs> I know it's Friday because my suitcases are in the hall. And we're like, what do you mean your suitcases are in the hall? Where are you going? Costa Rica. He, didn't tell us. <laughs> he never tells us until the last day before he's about out the door. I don't know why I thought I did. I really did think I brought this one up. I didn't. I didn't bring this up at no. the aquarium oh. that I was going for a birthday. You did. I didn't know it was this weekend. Oh, okay. I See, I did, okay, it. I brought it up to KK. Does yeah. that count? I did, brought it up to one person. No, that's right. Because we were talking about the long weekend and what we were doing, and I was joking. I'm going out of town a whole two hours away. Yeah. And you're like, I'm going to Costa Rica. Why are you telling her? She doesn't even know what day it is. <laughs> <laughs> that's a fair point. Mo He's done this before with the Maldives. He tells us on Friday he's going halfway across the world. Dubai. 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 Rome. Uh, Rome. <laughs> Don't even tell us about that. I didn't see that one on Instagram. <laughs> All right, so from now on, when I'm going somewhere, y'all yeah. want me to just walk into their room and announce it? Yes. It's, okay. So okay. I guess when I'm planning my trips or I have something going on and exciting in my life, I just share it with these guys during commercials or when you guys are listening to songs or whatever. It'll just come up, right? I think part of it is because... These are my friends, but also I'm trying to keep us all from just like being totally focused on anything but our personalities. <laughs> I'm trying to keep the, the room warm, right? But for and you're also excited because you love to travel. I love who to does, travel. Who doesn't want to share like to, with your friends? Oh my God, I get to go to X place. Like the first thing I did when you walked, you were barely in the door today. I'm like, you guys, I'm going to the surf ranch. Yes. And that's not until June. <laughs> all right. <laughs> so Mo comes in here. What is Costa Rica this weekend? Uh, it's my uh, lady's birthday celebration. For okay. the so like, yeah, like a group of us are going to Costa Rica to celebrate. That's fantastic, man. I love how instead of choosing, hey, let's go to this steakhouse in our city, you're like, <laughs> let's go to Costa Rica. No, I would have preferred the steakhouse in the city. This was not my <laughs> choice, but this is what she wanted to do, so this is what we're doing. Good now, keep her. in mind, when Dude joined the show, he hadn't traveled anywhere. This is, like, really exciting that you had never traveled well, until... No. Not anywhere. I mean, I've probably been like five places. I oh, just, yeah. Yeah, I've, I've, I, went, I went to like Mexico, the, the Puerto Rico, the typical places. I just never went like like really traveled. The way that I'm traveling now, these 10-hour plus trips, I, I've never done that before, no. So where in Costa Rica are you going or do you even, you don't even know? No idea. No Costa idea. Rica. That's all so, I got. So they just tell you what time to be at the airport and you just get on the plane and you just roll with it. Literally. That is all I know. I don't know where I'm staying. I don't know what part we're in. Don't I don't know. know where I'm landing. I, I <laughs> just mean, know I'm going to Costa Rica. You haven't been able to do what a person with anxiety does. <laughs> and that is you research where you're staying. And then you also research, okay, is this a resort? Do they have restaurants? Well, let's check out the restaurants. Well, we got to check out the restaurant menu. So I know what I want to order. What if I go to said restaurant? At some point, I'm going to be on an ATV. That's all I got. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I got. All right. Yeah, th this is how I live my life. I've. I woke up at 5.30. I was in such a rush. I had to finish packing my bags. 
I reached in my pocket. I realized I forgot to put my ring cam back on my door. It's in my pocket. <laughs> okay, this is how I live my life, y'all. <laughs> He's literally holding his ring cam right now. I just realized that I was charging it, and I put it in my pocket to put it on the door as I left. Yeah. And I ran here, and it's in my pocket now. So <laughs> there's that. That's, that's how I live my life. So you can do this. He can do this because others are organizing the trip for him. So yes. you have mm-hmm. enough confidence in them that you don't even have to do the research. Right? Exactly that. Because I don't like to do the research. I hate that part. Well, if you really think about it, I mean, and this is speaking generally, like I know in my household, I make all the plans when it comes to trips. I book the Airbnb or VRBO. I book like the excursions. I book where, you know, um, I I book where we're going. So um, I think a lot of times there are spouses and there are husbands who just... Show up and have no idea what you're doing or where you're going, what the place looks like that you're staying, etc. It's lovely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, have a good time in whatever city you're going to in Costa Rica. Thank you. On your ATV. <laughs> I appreciate it. Um, I might be getting there by ATV. I don't know. <laughs> My guess is like you're going somewhere. Like, does the, the the words Manuel Antonio ring a bell at all? I don't know either one of those guys. Okay. <laughs> 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 <Okay>. <laughs> All right, have a good trip. Thank you. <laughs> right. The Burt Show.